What's up, you guys? This is Mary with HPI, High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, Cap through Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with us. Free general collective reading. 12 7 2022 8 42 a.m i hope everybody's doing well okay so i received a couple downloads um we're going to do this reading real quick i might do some signed readings today hope everybody's doing well okay so the channel message i received was um i heard a very dark side of um i heard aquarius heavy air sign so um uh, gemini libra aquarius with heavy aquarian placements i think they have two or two plus aquarius placements but they're very dark side so Think they might practice dark arts or have in the past or manifest on the dark side or something but dark side aquarius um dark side air sign with aquarius so gemini libra aquarius with heavy aquarian placements two or two plus aquarian placements rain may be significant thunderstorms may be significant or something of that nature okay but uh because it's raining here confirmation for somebody possibly but anyways i heard um this dark side person i heard they want to um for one it's a masculine one's a feminine they're masculine okay so two of them two dark side air sign heavy aquariuses one's a masculine energy one's a femme a femme that takes on heavy masculine but how that resonates and i didn't hear a sign on you they want to harness your sexual sexual energy um i heard to siphon it um for themselves um whoever you are and have this applies one it's a masculine uh air sign dark side air sign with heavy aquarius one is a femme in their masculine um how this resonates and applies you guys somebody needs to be careful they want to harness your sexual energy um for themselves basically um uh, and if that would make sense if they're on the dark side sex is the biggest form of energy sharing um when they have sex with you they suck your good energy for themselves Whoever you are, I didn't hear a sign on you. Somebody needs to be careful if you're in a relationship or you're prostituting or whatever the crap this is, okay? For one, they want to offer you to be their um, sugar, that sugar mama. For one, prostitution. For one, you're in a relationship with them. For one, they want to offer you to be their sugar mama. Um, one, it's prostitution. And one, you're in a relationship with them. So for one, they want to offer you to be their sugar mama. Um, so I'm assuming you're a femme energy. Um, but they would pay you. or well, offer you to be their sugar mama. So sugar mamas, sugar mamas pay. For sex like sugar daddies like prostitution so i think it's a femme energy offering to pay you for sex like you're their mistress that's what i think i think it's the femme in our heavy um the mask uh femme in our heavy mask one. that's what i think i think she's got, wants to be your sugar mama is what i think i think she wants to be your sugar mama um and she wants to offer you sex so she would be your sugar mama to pay you for sex that's that's what i think that's what i think sugar mama yeah she wants to be your sugar mama. Ew, that's nasty. For one, it's prostitution. And for one, um, you're in a relation, current relationship with them, whether they're dark side masculine or the femme um, that takes on heavy masculine. Um, I wouldn't do it, you guys. Hell to the his no. Hell to the his no. Oh, oh. Okay, so that was the first one. Okay, so we're at 4.15. Four uh, minutes and 15 seconds. That's the first one. The second one, I heard, um, these are about to seriously backfire on these people. They're about to seriously be publicly exposed and very embarrassed. Okay, I heard, okay, so these situations with these dark side ear signs, with whether they're a feminine, heavy masculine, like a dom dominatrixy type person. But they won't come off like they're dominatrixy, not at first. But in the bedroom, they are. Um, and the way they harness sexual energy and the way they manifest off. So they do things in sneaky, shy ways, basically. And for one, uh, it's a masculine. 
but these people are about to get publicly exposed very, very, very embarrassed. Well, they shouldn't be doing it on the dark side. If you're going to do it, just be honest about it. Hell, I love to have sex, but have I had sex in three years? Fuck no. Do I want to have sex? Fuck no. You come near me, I'll report rape on your ass, and that's just the truth for me. Um, but just be honest about whatever the hell you do, and that's just the truth. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. Someone's get, I'm serious. I heard someone's getting a huge wake-up call. Well, it's the damn truth. Um, rape and incest is wrong and nasty. And I don't want to have sex with anybody. Anybody comes near me and tries to force me into anything, I, you better believe I'm calling 911. You better believe I'm calling the police to get you off my property. You better believe I'm not going anywhere with you. Re hashtag report rape and incest. But I heard these people are about to be very publicly exposed. Um, and some negative tower bombs are going to happen for them. Well, that's what they get for harnessing, trying to harness your sexual energy. For some of you guys, I feel they already have because you're in a relationship with them. Um, and if you're noticing they're going, 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 going up and you're going, going, going down, that's a good indication that they're negatively harnessing their sexual energy from the one you're in a relationship with this person, if you might need to hear that, okay? Okay, so that was the first one. The second one I heard, um, a fem energy that has a hidden camera in her home in the past and her entire city and community withheld it from her. I heard it's a bit about to get around like wildfire to outside her community and it's about to go fast and it's about to get to very light side important people. And I heard people are about not to mess around about this. There's about to be huge communication like wildfire soon. And I heard people are not going to mess around and they're actually going to help this time. So you plug it in, how it resonates. And that's a good one. Good one. <clears throat> and I hope that's for me. I hope that's for me. Because we all know I had a hidden camera in my past, in my house in the past, even though our city still refuses to tell me. But, and my, even my crazy ass family refused it, uh, refused to tell me. Um, and I paid a private invest, uh, not a private investigator. I paid a ex-cop to come scan my house, $350 of my hard-earned money to come scan for the safety of me and my children. Oh, the battery must have died, was his excuse, as he's standing there with his little wife, little um, sidekick wife. They probably thought it was funny when they left and went to go eat all my money. And I'm just being for real. But I found out later in a CPS report, because you have the right to ask, if somebody comes to your house with CPS, and CPS gets called on you. You have the right to ask what the report is. They won't tell you who made it, but you have the right to ask what it's um what the report states why they were called. And the report for me, one of them six in a year, I might add. One of them was when I asked the CPS worker was I was walking around my bra my underwear. Well, how the hell you know I'm walking around my bra my underwear if there's no not a hidden camera in my house? I even. Gave the social worker, the CPS worker, food for thought for that. But she says she tried to remove my kids, which is a crimp. It's that's wrong. That's wrong. She wasn't doing her job right, and that's just the truth. So that's just my story. But I know a lot of you guys had hidden cameras in your house in the past. Maybe your city and your community try to cover it up too, just like mine. I'm not sure. Only you know your situation and story. Anybody else? But. I heard basically, um, whether that is the case for you or not, uh, hopefully this is for me and many of you guys, uh, but I don't know. But how this resonates, if this applies for you, a hidden camera, there was a hidden camera in your house in the past, your city and community strategically hid it, covered it up from you. But like I said, I found out anyways, whether my city and community wanted to know. I found out anyways. And my family, my family covered it up for me too. And still has to this, still has to this day, and that's just the truth. But I still know from the CPS report, so they can, you know, if we, I'll never speak to my toxic family ever a day in my life again because of that. But, but if we ever do, like at a funeral or something, and they bring it up, you better believe I'll bring up the CPS report in 2021 and the gang stalking of 2020 and 2019. And that's just the truth. Facts. And that was my life, unfortunately. And my family was behind it. And do I think my family was behind my kids being carted off to my 
perverted pedophile ex-husband? Yeah, I do. Just saying. But anyway, so okay, if this resonates for you, there was a hidden camera in your in your home in the past, your um, community and your uh, surrounding community, and for some, your family could have helped cover it up in the past. But I heard soon it's about to get out outside your city and community to people that actually care and will help and will ch like change maker, true change maker energy. Um, the people in your community want to keep you stuck and stagnant in abuse and um, craziness. But it's about to get around to a change maker or change makers that will actually help you. They're about to help in huge ways, soon and quickly. Okay, I heard they're about to help in huge ways, soon and quickly. Well, good. They're about to help in huge ways soon and quickly because that's the way it should go. Especially if you put good into the universe and you don't hurt and harm other people. Um, and that's just the truth. Um, and whoever you are, I don't feel you do. You're very high vibrational. You're very high vibrational. You're very high vibrational. Well, good. Good. That's good. So you treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and value. So it sounds like the energy is about to return back to you with somebody outside your community about to help you, and they operate in morals, ethics, integrity, and values as well. Um, I would love to know about this, hear about this, if you are willing to um, share it. Okay. okay, so that was the second one. And then the other one was, I heard a uh, Libra feminine is about to be, uh, she's already in deep shit. She's about to be in more deep shit. She's a very abusive um a very abusive liar. I heard she's been lying for years and abusing you for years. Now, whoever you are, I feel you can be masculine or femme. She's a Libra femme. She could have Libra on her sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, Henry, she could charge. I feel you can be masculine or feminine. But she's been lying on you or about you or about the situation and abusing you for years, whoever you are. Um, it's about to backfire on her in such a huge way. It's about to backfire on her in such a huge way. So it's about to backfire on her in such a huge way. But she's been lying about the situation or lying about you and abusing you. Whoever you are, sir or ma'am. You mean masculine or feminine. Very dark side Libra femme. She can have Libra under sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, hammer, Jupiter, charts. People like that are sick. And they're mentally ill is what that is. They're mentally ill. They need some treatment is what they need. And away from um, people like like, they need to have isolation to think about what they're, they do. Kind of like jail and prison. That's what it's intended for. The hidden camera that was strategically hidden in this community and surrounding areas in this community for so long, it's about to get out. It got out in the spiritual realm in the past. People made a lot of money off this in the spiritual realm. A lot of money. But it's about to get out to actual 3D world. And it is about to go fast. Okay, so I heard, okay, so the one that had the hidden camera in the house in the past, so it reminds me of Secret 7, like me, because I was Secret 7, and that's just the truth. Um, the original Secret 7. There was many you had Secret 7 after that because they knew they could get away with it. but. I was the original Secret 7, but my point is, whether whoever you are, whether it ends up being me or one of you guys, um, um, it's about to get out. To, I heard uh, it got out to the spiritual realm in the past, so other readers, other spiritualists, dark and light side spiritualists, other readers, and they basically talked about it in the spiritual realm, kind of um, obviously not straight up about it, because you can't talk about Secret 7 in terror readings because I have it copyrighted. But they did talk about it in the spiritual realm and they made a lot of money off of it. As long as you follow the policies and procedures of terror readings and um, public, public platform guidelines, you can. And they did. And they, I'm, I know they were pulling my energy and they did for a hot, a hot, hot ass minute. I know they did. They pulled my energy for a hot minute. And they made a lot of money off that. And still to this day, some of them pull my energy and that's just the truth. I can tell from the reading. But how this resonates, whether it's me or somebody else that had a hidden camera in their house in the past, the spiritual realm made a shit ton of money off of it. But did you ever see these readers call the FBI to help me? No, they were making boo of money off of me, but did you ever see them call the FBI to help me? 
I just want to put some food for thought on that. Just saying, just saying. Um, but uh, I heard it's about to get to people actually in the everyday 3D world to get some help, whether it's me or somebody else. Well, good. Because it's like making money off a situation and not helping it. Like, I'm all, I mean, I'm very altruistic. Very altruistic. But don't take advantage of people. And that's basically what a lot of these people in the spiritual realm that did. They took advantage of me and my family in the situation. And that's just the truth. Call it how I see it. Okay, so, um, oh, the other one I heard, so that Libra is about being deep shit, right, right? And then I heard there's a Pisces under very heavy investigation. One, they're a lawyer. One, they're a nurse. One, they are a, a CNA. Heard they work in a clinic. I heard it's about to go badly for all three of them. So heavy Piscean energy. Um, whether they're a nurse, a, a CNA, or a nurse. I mean, a nurse, like LPN, RN, CRNP, a um, CNA, certified nursing assistant, or a um, lawyer. They're under heavy investigation, masculine or feminine. I heard it's not going to go well for them. It's not going to go well at all. It's not going to go well at all. Yeah, they're under heavy investigation, but they're under a heavy investigation for a reason. I heard it's not going to go well at all. And one of these people stole money from a, uh, one of you high vibrational beings in the past, and that's about to backfire. Okay, so they're under very heavy investigation, but one of these people, I heard it's not going to go well for them, but one of them stole a lot of money from you a high vibrational being in the past. Um, and it's about to backfire on them. So they not only, they're not only under investigation with their profession, but they stole a crap ton of money from you in the past. Like, do the right thing. These, This is an example of being in a position of authority or a high authority or a pos prominent position in the community and abusing your power. Be my to hear that. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful day and namaste.